Hello everybody. Today we'll be uh checking out a new a new project that I've been working on. And it was not only me. I'm actually working in a group now. It was really, really cool. Uh so let me let me show you all the features. So we got like a new sign over here, we got a new face, we got a whole lot of new textures, obviously. So yeah, that's pretty cool. And uh, you know, since that since that R143 cap, yeah, we have, we got we had to do the cap, you know, we had to do the cap, yeah, to make it realistic as hell, yeah. Yeah, so I added uh, some features and I still gotta work on some stuff, but uh yeah. So let's go check things out. So first things first, you wanna you're gonna walk in here and realize, damn, there's a bunch of new textures. Uh, is it because I got them from a lot, a lot of different uh, pictures? Yeah, I just realize I still have to work on a lot of them. Like there's some textures that haven't been changed, like this one, for example, this part, and uh, technically this one. But uh, overall, this is the most accurate you could have ever see a R46 so far. Apart from the 1960s and 70s other which is, uh, it's pretty cool. Uh, we also have the door stickers over here, which are on the walls already. So, uh, the normal R46 didn't have those door numbers, but now, in this one, you can. So that's pretty cool. So yeah, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, yeah, okay. Uh, so yeah, moving on from that, uh, there are various things that I do need to change though, uh, obviously. Like for example, this part, is, uh, definitely not supposed to be like that. So. It's also really cool because it's so it's nice. It's okay. Uh, I'm gonna have to de get a different texture for this back part. I got to change one of these textures. I forgot. I'm gonna check it out soon. But yeah, then again, door stickers and also yeah, it's pretty cool. Oh yeah, also I have I have some new light textures and overhead textures. I still need to work on the overhead lights though. These part. Yeah, obviously that's a that's a beta. Yeah. Oh yeah, we also do have this special exterior. Uh, of course, this is a little test to see how how it looked like in BVE. Uh, turns out good and bad at the same time. So I'll probably like put it on opacity fifty, so it could like I don't know make the normal one look realistic. Uh, should probably add COVID sticker over here. Yeah. This this is only a beta. This is only a beta. So uh yeah, there there'll be better things coming soon, obviously. If you don't believe that, we'll kind of push it on your tail. So let's go check out not. Let's go check out the cab. So of course, nothing really much changed on the cab. Just like the window part of the thing, and a little few features just like this part. This part of the wall. Uh, this thing down here. Which I don't even know that what that is. I mean this this wall diagonal and all that stuff. So yeah. And uh yeah, overall nothing really much changed on the cab. Apart from like the window texture. Uh without for okay, now here's the section I wanted to uh comment. How 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 did how did I get invited into a project? <sighs> well, it all started when I was in a server. A nice tiny little server where uh where I was uh, busy on on stream in Discord in the Discord call streaming the a new A train line that I've been working on. It's not it's not really new, nor is it entirely me. It's more of a again modification. Yeah, obviously a modification. Uh, modifying it so it's actually more realistic than it is. Like for example, uh, this part over here, it's not actually straight. There's actually a curve around here. Two specific curves, yeah. Uh, but yeah, it's it's not straight. So yeah, this, this part is so inaccurate. They didn't really they 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 bear, they um, they technically only paid attention to the stations, and partially the tunnels, only partially. Anyway, so I was showcasing that, and then someone was like, "Oh my god, that looks cool." Uh, so then this got attention of some dude called Mystic, and he put me in a, D a Discord DM with, with another guy. We went on call and started talking about it, and then he was like, 
And, and then he cut to the chase and asked me if I wanted to join the Mystic Transit server in order to join a bunch a bunch of more OpenBVE developers and modders so I could work on future projects just like that. And I said, yeah, sure, why not? I like that. Sounds pretty great. So, well, here I am. And uh, this project, just an idea that they had. So, yeah, it's pretty cool. But, uh, yeah. So I'm just going to do a little sign scroll. Yeah, okay, so I got that. Okay. Um, so what I'm trying to so what I'm trying to plan on next, uh textures correction textures correction, more edit features if I th if I find that some of them are also more if some more of them are also missing. Uh, more variety in the seat textures, obviously. Uh, a 3D LED box, because like it's 2D, and I'm lagging right here right now, so I'm gonna pause it. It's on a real fan a lot. Okay, so okay, so texture texture fixing and enhancing. Uh, 3D LED box, like the LED the LED interior box over there. Uh, the, the, the chains, the chain on the side of the car, at, e at each end and stuff. And, uh, stuff like that. Let me go in depth about those next few features that I want to add. So, of course, we got, we already got the new trucks and stuff, so we don't, we don't need to worry about that, obviously. No, but there's also another thing that it was, that we need to worry about. It's, uh... We need to add the chain somewhere around here. Uh, maybe add a maybe add like the the door side texture down here. Uh, we we're planning on making this this part three D. So yeah, we'll see how that turns out. I I also had a idea to give a more variety to the to the seat textures because they're only like one pattern. There's a bunch of patterns as you know. So uh, yeah, plan on changing that obviously. Uh. Oh yeah, there's also gonna be some different ads. So yeah, again, this is only a beta. So yeah, please don't expect much from this. Actually, expect expect some amount. I mean, I don't know. Fucking, you tell me. But uh, yeah, this is gonna be way different once it's done. So I think I don't know. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much gonna do it. Thanks for watching and uh, bye.